the fall, the late fall, is really a special, special time. You know, there's not, we haven't seen another soul out here. And, you know, you don't have the numbers of fish that you do earlier in the fall and the late summer. Um, but it's the trade-off is coming out here and seeing a big, beautiful steelhead river with no people on it. I'd much rather fish a river with no people and not very many fish than a lot of fish and a whole bunch of people. I was marching down the east bank, hung up twice, lost a fly, a big fish. and just came tight. Big pull, a couple of tail wags. We got got the fish to hand and just exploded on the on the line. And that's too bad. Off she goes. fishing small, intimate water. You know, you jump into these big runs that are 200 yards long, you can spend a lot of time just kind of wasting time. You kick that fly out of, out of tension in, into your men, you feel it basically just sink down, you feel your whole Skagit head just sink, you lift your tip and just bring the fly into tension, and you just know that thing's hunting, you know? It's on the hunt down there. And sometimes, you know, you can feel it. You can feel when you're going to get a grab. You can feel it when the fish are around. And this, this spot I felt pretty good about coming into, but... Oh man, the grab was amazing. I mean, it was such a good eat. No hesitation, just pile drive. Nice little fish. I mean, that's why you fish right there. It's just the eat. That's the whole deal.